Woody Point is at the end of uh, Route 431, right in the middle of Grossmoor National Park. I would say it's one of the most beautiful areas I've ever been in, and uh, probably a little bit biased there, but I've kicked around over the years and I haven't seen a more beautiful place to be or to, or to live, really. It's surrounded by beautiful mountains. It's a natural fjord, so the glaciers carved out what we have. Uh, to the south of Woody Point, you can see the tablelands. You know, where else can you go to find that? We always had, I guess, artists traveling through the area, but now we tend to have more artists come in and settle for a while. And basically, I guess, Woody Point becomes an inspiration to many people around the world. Well, Woody Point is very proud that uh, we host quite a number of artistic and musical events during the summer. We are the home for writers at Woody Point. It's now in its 10th year. And then we have Grossmore and Summer Music that brings in uh, classical music and performance art. And of course, after things happen at the theatre, it all spews out into the community. You know, you go down to the Legion and you go down to the waterfront and, there, and there, there's people sitting around, like the jam sessions going on all over the place, so it's continuing to grow. As Woody Point's artistic community grows, it is also growing on the local population that have lived here all of their lives. There's a heck of a lot of talent here, and the people who are from here won't say that they have any talent. I guess I'm creative to a, to a certain degree, but I'm not really, uh, I certainly don't consider myself to be an artist. I started making art as a necessity in, uh, in, in past times. If somebody needed a, a house, well, they kind of had to build one. Or if you need your house painted, well, you painted your house. Because we just did it, so I think Newfoundlanders in general are very creative because we, we've had to be over the years. Woody Point is becoming the heart of Grossmore National Park, culturally speaking anyway, because people can come here. We have the uh, bed and breakfast experience. We have the uh, local restaurants that offer local cuisine, like it could be moose pie, or it could be something from the sea. People are always coming through and they were only meaning to be here for a day, and they end up staying for a week or two weeks. It's nice because they become part of the community. Yeah, I'm certainly excited to see artists come here and, 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 and work to bring in our community to the world. And uh, I think that most people in the community are glad to see them come because it's bringing, a new, it's bringing a, new, a new life into the community, you know? It's good for everybody.